I stopped feeling bad for people, people that don't get what they deserve or good people that don't get what they deserve, whatever. Why? Because why aren't you choosing what you deserve? It's the truth. If you really believe, if, if somebody else really believes that they deserve something better, why aren't they choosing it? If you feel like you deserve a better relationship, why aren't you choosing it? And why should I feel bad for you not choosing something different? If you feel like you deserve more money or deserve a better job or deserve to be treated, why aren't you choosing situations or at least choosing to not be in situations that are less than you deserve? What we want a lot of times is a pity party. We want enough people to agree that we deserve better so that we can point the finger at the person not giving us better or the situation not giving us better or the government not giving us better and enough people can march and rally and be like, give that person this and change for this person instead of that person changing for themselves and choosing something different. Why the fuck aren't you doing that? We want enough validation from the 3D that says this thing must change for me so that I can feel good about who I am instead of I feel good about who I am so I change this person or situation's stance in my life. You put the power in something else's hands and demand it to change. You point the finger and blame something else. I keep moving this thing. You point the finger and blame something or someone else and be like, you're the reason I'm not who I think I should be, or I'm not able to be who I want to be or do what I want to do. So um, you must change so that I feel good about myself. It's your responsibility to me for you to change the way that you show up in my life so that I can believe something good about me. How insane is that? Choose something different. <laughs> like, Choose something different. I am done feeling bad for people like that. I used to be the type of person that would look at something and be like, oh like this person didn't deserve this or like this that and the third it's like don't get me wrong betrayals and stuff happen or like shitty situations happen like that and i'm not saying like you know but when you perpetuate a story over and over again and you choose the same thing the same outcome the same you make the same decision thinking that your loyalty to that decision will then make it change for you and then blame the thing is just insanity to me. It's so insane. Um, it's so insane and also disempowering. Part of me does want to say like pathetic. Trust me, I've been that person. I'm not trying to be like, I've never been that person, but I've been that person, but it is pathetic. Like, in my opinion. But what you deserve really doesn't matter if you don't choose what you deserve. Who cares? You know, that's why people with like, people are like, why do bad people get all this whatever? Or like, this person gets all that in like, um, you know, they don't even do half the stuff I do. Or like, they don't even act as nice. They don't even sacrifice themselves as much. But this person gets like this and that. And that's like, yeah. So maybe they don't have like a concept that they aren't like worthy of that thing. <laughs> and that they could just have what they want. Maybe that's the way reality works instead of you have to earn and deserve and like all this stuff. And like, if that works for you, then that works for you. I feel like it doesn't work for a lot of people. Um, it's not to say don't be a version of yourself you're not proud of or whatever, like be the best version of yourself, but yeah, what you deserve has like literally nothing to do. What you, what you, what everybody else validates you and tells you do you deserve or like all your friends tell you do you deserve and stuff has nothing to do with what you'll get if you don't choose what you want. 
you choose what you want. You don't earn what you deserve to get what you want. It doesn't, if it worked that way, you wouldn't be throwing a fit about the shit that you're not getting because you're doing everything right, like quote unquote, you know, you wouldn't be throwing a fit about what you can't manifest or somebody won't text you back or that like you don't have enough money and this and that. Like you wouldn't be doing that. If that's the way that reality worked, instead of the way that you're pointing the finger and demanding that it work while it hasn't worked that way, it would have worked by now. I'm sorry, it would have fucking worked by now and it doesn't work like that, does it? Doesn't work the way you were brought up where it's like, ah, you do this to get this. Because then you wouldn't be throwing such a pissy fit when you don't get what you feel like you worked for or what you feel like you earned or what you feel like you deserve based off what you did or how much you pushed or how kind you, all this stuff, like, no. It's literally just what you choose what you choose so my question to you is why the fuck are you choosing whatever you're choosing instead of demanding what you choose to change why don't you change what the fuck you choose why don't you change who the fuck you choose why don't you change how you show up not to get a different outcome Maybe to get a different outcome, I don't fucking know. But if you aren't liking what you're choosing, why the fuck are you choosing it? I, I deal with the shit all the time where somebody comes to me and is like, I'm very straight with advice. And like, if you tell me you're, you're like, choose a different reality, it's, it's, it's literally that easy. Um, and if I were to sit here and give like, call somebody and feel bad and like, give them the advice of like, you know, um, that person must change. They have to see. I can't do that. I'd be an idiot <laughs> if I if I give you that advice. I would just be a, a liar. <laughs> I'd be a liar and I would be useless. Okay, because there's nothing you can do to point to that person to make them change so that you believe something different about yourself. It doesn't start there. Believe something different about yourself and then the situation changes. Choose something different for yourself. That's all, Cho choose something different. Like you don't like the relationship that you're in. You feel like they don't, they don't give you what you deserve and all this stuff. Stop pointing the finger at them and being like, become what I deserve. Become what I just choose what the fuck you deserve. Go choose what you deserve because that thing is not going to change into what you want it to change in by you uh, constantly pointing at it at least and being like, become what I deserve. Become enough, become this so that I can feel like enough. Go feel like enough and choose what is enough for you. Don't look at your job and be like, give me enough, I deserve this. Choose something different. There's always something different for you. There's always something better for you. If you can imagine it, you can have it. You're just choosing to be in the situation that makes you believe something that's not true about yourself. You're choosing to be in a situation that shows you something painful that makes you believe and perpetuate a belief that you have about you that is painful and therefore not true. Choose something different. Look somewhere different. Does that mean change the person? Does that mean change the job? Not necessarily. It means stop putting it in that thing's hands to change so that you can feel good about who you are. Stop making the 3D responsible for how you feel about you, for what is true about you. It's not showing you anything that's true about you. It's showing you what you truly believe about you. There is nothing that's solid and concrete and true that stays forever. So if you believe you're useless, worthless, don't deserve this, whatever, that's not solid. That shit can change. That can change. The outcome that you get can change. None of that's ultimately true. And what's being shown to you and the way you feel about yourself because of it isn't ultimately true. It's what you're deciding to look at. It's the experience that you're allowing in your reality. And it's ability, what you're witnessing, 
giving it the power to dictate what is true about you. It's all in your hands. There's literally nothing you're powerless to. And this is why I don't feel bad for people that do not get good people that don't get what they deserve out of a relationship out of this. Stop perpetuating a story and stop looking to people to validate that the 3D should change for you, for you to feel in your power, for you to feel the truth of who you are. It's absurd. It's absolutely absurd. And it does no service for you. So.